watch as I remove all the text and special characters in my numerical column revenue in one step using Power Query in Power BI. So here's my data and you see all these dollar sign, thousands, millions, M, billions, BN, that I want to get rid of. To do that, I'm going to add a custom column. I'll go to add column, click on custom column. Then I'm going to type in my Power Query formula. So once we're done typing in our Power Query script, we're going to check for errors. So you check here, no syntax errors have been detected. So I think that should work. So I'm going to rename my column to um, the suitable name. So this is going to be estimated revenue, estimated revenue, right? So, and then we're going to click, okay, yes. So. I'm going to show you what this formula does. So I'm going to explain that. So now what this formula does is it's going to replace every instance where it sees dollar signs. It's going to replace that with nothing. And every instance where it um, finds um, a text ending with M, it's going to extract one character from that text, that is the M, and it's going to multiply the numerical value with 1 million. So that's like 1 and 6 zeros. So if it sees K, it's going to represent the same thing. But when it comes to billion, which is BN, it's going to extract two characters. Now that's different. And I also provided other conditions based on the values I have in that column. So I'm going to cancel this and reorder my data so you can see a side by side of the dirty and the clean. Columns. So I'm going to move this to the very end so I can just show you a comparison. So you can see a side by side of my initial dirty column and my new clean column ready for analysis. So why I have 543.7 million dollars here, I have it just numerical so I can work with that in my analysis. And with this, I was able to create and clean this column in a single step in power query now that's the power of data cleaning in power query in power bi and that's a whole lot of powers